If you've ever been interested in learning how to weld, well, if you are, take Mr. Link's class. It's only nine weeks. You learn how to braze with an oxyacetylene welder, how to use an arc welder, and how to cut. But first, you just got to clean off your metal. You got to use the grinder. It's called a Millie. Mr. Link would be proud of you if you learn how to use that. Uh, I took the class my freshman year, and I really enjoyed it. And I myself am thinking about going on the pipeline to weld. I think everybody should learn how to weld because it keeps everything together, like this table. This table's held together by welds. That chair ta Caleb's sitting on back there is held together by welds. You gotta learn how to do, man. It's gonna be good if you do. You make a lot of money. Any students interested in joining track and field, please see the nurse to make sure you have all your paperwork completed for your physicals. Also, the season begins on Monday, March 2nd. If you are not on the list that the nurse hands to the coaches, you will not be able to practice until all paperwork is completed. Seniors. Your final trip payment is due to Mr. Montanaro on or before March 16th. And your slideshow pictures are also due to Mr. Montanaro on or before March 31st. Recently, a unit of 91 troops left Indiana PA for a deployment to Afghanistan. One of those troops were former NCHS student Josh Nalen. The high school student council will be holding a drive of needed supplies during the month of February. Items collected will be packaged and sent to the unit during the first part of March. If you are wanting to purchase a yearbook, log on to www.jostinsyearbooks.com. The cost is a base price of $63 plus tax. Today's weather will be a high of 44 and a low of 36. There will be a 50% chance of rain. Today's lunch will be French onion chicken, baked beans, seasoned green beans, and tropical pineapple tidbits. Hey, our school has a new weekly newsletter. Check it out!